Welcome back guys to another one of these C Games group stage replays. This time, it is gonna be a PvP between Singapore as well as Indonesia. So starting here on the bottom right, so let's introduce our purple Protoss. It's gonna be Enrique, also known as Quantel. In the meantime, here on the top left, it is gonna be the green Protoss of Kvankovic or Blisk instead. So honestly, Blisk, if you guys didn't know, had such a good run in this tournament. Really showing that he does deserve that contention to be one of the best in the region. But just not, not yet. Not yet. It has been a while for him. He did come back recently. He did get some nationalization into Singapore. He, he retired for a little bit because he, he did like all the way back in the day. You could say Blisk was really one of the best two that in the C region has to offer and still is. But I feel like as a, like many of the C region, it's not really still their heyday anymore. Or they're trying to come back into their greatness from before. Watching like all of their old old stuff. Seeing who they were facing off before and comparing it now. But anyway, we are going to be able to see Enrique here go for the Cybercore, going to go for that Gateway as well. In terms of positioning, two Gate here for our Purple Protoss. In terms of positioning, as we are saying, he is going to be deciding to play on that main wall on it. Doesn't need to, it's PvP. At the same time, Kovankovic a little bit more on the defense, will decide for a little bit more of that wall action as well. Make sure no Zealots, no Adepts run in straight into the middle line. But Stalker should be able to go for a chase. Two Gates here for both sides, Twin Assimilators as well. On to a one base scenario, we go here for both, and Kabakovic gonna decide to go for a proxy gateway in the middle of the map. So first things first, this proxy gateway is also a proxy pilot, and since it's not the closest, but it is gonna be enough, it's hidden behind some debris. So we will not be able, we will not be expecting Quantel to check this out. And of course, you need that one gateway to go for those warp cycles a lot quicker. We are gonna get Quantel right now, going for twin stalkers, and Quantel. This year has been really doing great in the Indonesian scene. Like before in ESG 2018 Indonesia, already bowed out early in that first round. Oh, we got Bliss putting a little bit of that cock block action, putting that pylon in the way. But as I was saying, it has really been Wantel's year in ascent in the in his local scene, making it to WESG, showing up here on C Games as well. Was doing a lot of good so far, and now it is going to be time for this probe to go down. The two stalkers are in position. That's going to be the show there, and then, in the meantime, we are going to get one stalker warped in here for Kvankovic. He is going to go for an early Twilight Council as well. No forge next whatsoever. No second base, and this might be actually Blink Stalker versus the Stalker Immortal composition because we already have Guantel with that proxy robo. Seems like both of these guys decided to play a little bit of that cheeky since it's the group stage anyway. But this might be very dangerous here for Bliss. He doesn't pay attention. That Immortal is going to go for a so, so successful backstab when he is able to, what, two, three shot these Stalkers in an instant. Anyway, though, we are going to get Warp Gate Research online here and now for both Blisk a little ahead. But at the same time, here we go with the Immortal going for that Artosis Pylon. And that's going to be a recall already from Kovatkovich. One more shot. Can he actually get it? No, Quantel so close. Oh my god, the save. The save, the Warp Prism comes in the nick of time. But I will love just one more shot. One more shot will shut everything down. And that was very smart there from Blisk as well. Went for immediate recall. Probes were pulled at the same time to be able to fend that Immortal off. And they were trying to get rid of the sightlines, force the Immortal to go on down in a stand. Anyway, still, does Kovankovic not know that the Robo is there? He does not! The Robo facility gonna be able to bruise another Immortal yet again. Sentry's being warped in as well. It's all about that mech play here. And now, one base all in here from Quantel. Kovankovic was trying to do the same with a gateway, but seems like it's not the case. Because this second Nexus is gonna go down really, really soon. Blink Stalker, though, might be the same grace here for Blisk. Will it be enough? He really is gonna go for all these Sentries at the same time. But that Immortal needs to go down the other one. Is still full HP, very dangerous waters here and now for our green Protoss. Good force field to isolate that one stalker. That's a free one there for Quantel. And then Rika, the purple, purple Protoss. You know, Regal Protoss looking really good, that's for sure. I like the color scheme of purple for them. We are gonna see a little bit of that warp cycle, Miss Micro to put the stalkers inside. 
But more or less, we should be expecting more gateways in production here and now for Quanzo. When you are in a situation where you're on the attack, you can just keep building gateways with your free money. Oh, a Zeb's coming in! And here we go with the Psyotic Transfer, looking to get into the middle of the line instead, or maybe pick off that sentry. He's trying to find the opportunity, and into the front line we go. This is gonna be Quanto going for the attack. Good micro to put that Immortal up on top yet again. And still, the pylon's going down here and now. Bliss doesn't have much supply behind this. This pylon's all the way in front. Probes are already filled. The warp prism is still alive and it is going to be trying to get on away. And the stalkers micro into oblivion. They're not able to take that one down. Blink stalker might come online soon. But the attack has already done its damage. This might be Quantel taking this one by storm. Two seconds left. Can combat give it micro those ones? Not going to happen as Blink finishes. The match finishes in the blink of an eye.